Hello, hello. Hello. Are you okay? Was it, you finished? Oh, right, okay. Finished, isn't it? Yeah, it did. Yes, yeah, so I feel... like she said finished. I'm pretty sure she did. <laughs> but, yeah. Oh, yeah. you did. You said finished. finished. Well done. You said finished. Very yes. <laughs> Oh, very good. Very good. Oh, little, com- little comedian. <laughs> now, before I check in with you, my darling, who is the, the main star of the show, um, how are we over here? Are we okay? Good. Yeah. Oh, you both got mouthfuls. Well done for not speaking with your mouthful. Um, but I wonder, have you finished what's in your mouth now, Hughes? Oh, nearly. Rue. Oh, no, Rue's still eating. No. Okay, you have now. What are you eating, I'm, buddy? I'm, uh, I'm eating some wheat and I've just finished my blueberries. Okay, um, cool. Wicked. And, and you? Oh, oh, you just put another one in. So you got to say, you got some cereal here and you got some blueberries in here. I'm about to eat it. You love to eat it. Well, that's nice. That's nice. Hello, my guy. Hi, sweetheart. Hi, sweetheart. You okay? Yeah, she's um, my sister. That is your sister. Absolutely. Hello, Baba. And she yeah, is mine. off, walking away. That is so funny. <laughs> Big girl. She's only had um, she's only had blueberries and oh, look, one mouthful of cereal, but she mm. seems to think she's done. She seems to think she's finished, and she's very opinionated. Yeah. There's something in the parent manual book that hasn't been written. They don't tell you. As you have more and more kids, they get stronger and stronger with. <laughs> well, this was what I was gonna ask, babe. Oh, we are doing a deep dive. I thought I'd ask you how difficult is it being a mother of. Seven. Now, I thought a good place to start. Our Where? minds must be connected, literally, because as I because when I had the three down here, I was like, oh, having three kids is a doodle. I wonder if the good boy gang would want to know, like, oh, it's so easy with three kids, or because the others were all upset about carry on. Mm, yeah, well, there <laughs> you go, so there nice. you go. That's good stuff. Give me a touch in here. Yes. <laughs> Um, yeah, so I just thought, because we haven't spoke at all this morning, I just told mummy, you know, I'm going to film at some point, be mm-hmm. ready. Like, that was it. Like, and I didn't even say be ready, actually. No, I said, you didn't even say that. <laughs> no, I just said, do what you're doing, and yeah, we'll I go from there. No don't ask no questions, I've got a plan. So, um, you've already finished your things. Wow, that is so good. Well done. Great eating. Great eating. Um, yeah, he would like a Nutella wrap. I will ask. Hey, now, I will ask someone else. To do I was that. gonna ask. Um, so first and foremost, you can hear them laughing upstairs. Yep. Oh, and you can hear this one. She's pushing the. She's the really? Can you sit on it? Can you sit on it? Don't push it along. <laughs> Don't push no. yeah, oh. Oh. Sorry, what is happening? Uh, we were just like, who can get ready the quickest? Oh, okay. I was doing it quickest, but then he yeah, he took some. Who dad, you didn't do your ears, did you? <laughs> you didn't do your ears. Little cheek. But had you done your ears, or was that a bit of a. No, I, was just, I still hadn't done it, but I remember that I needed to do it. So he was trying to throw up yeah. so you had more to do. Yeah. Well, yeah. there you go. Yes. And what I was going to ask, obviously, you can see yeah. our. Um, what is that? The folding? The, that's the folding. I, like, that's the stuff that needs to be folded. So, and, and just for clarity's sake, so, sorry, Hughes, two, two seconds, my baby. Um, just for clarity's sake, I know we, um, we, sh- we, we showed Jess to the Grimway gang. Yes. Now, Jess obviously does some things. Uh-huh. Um, she does, but, yeah. but we still do... A lot. Yeah. So basically, Jess will help me. So since we started We Make Footballers, I, I have to, like, obviously in the afternoons, twice a week, go to the classes. Well, I have been, yeah. We are kind of going through a process where sometimes I'll be there just to now take part, like, with my kids rather mm-hmm. than running it. Yeah. But anyway, for the past how many months, I have had to make sure that in the afternoon periods, so like between like four and then eight, I'm quite busy doing like work stuff. And what I was finding was that in the afternoons, after we've had dinner, I would then have like all the dishes to put away. She can come to me. Come, hello. I tell you what, if you let her come to me and you, I'll take her. She and just you wants to be on here, away. Okay, well, I'll like, stand yeah, you can stand, stand here. here. <laughs> We, yeah, 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 see, that's all she that's wanted. Yeah. Yeah. So I would find that t- dish, clear up the dishes and putting stuff away was all taking too long, mm-hmm. and then I'd have to rush out of the house, and, and then we'd all have to be doing it when we'd come back from our various um, activities. activities. But at that time, I didn't really want people in the kitchen tidy. I wanted them getting ready, having tea and getting ready for bed. Mm-hmm. So at the beginning of this year... Yay! Sorry, because prior to that, we had Jess and her husband come in once a week 
each week just mm. to do a full house clean. Yeah. Because otherwise it would be taking seven hours out of a day for mm. me to just, do you know what I mean? Or like clean the house, do the full clean. So they would come in once a week. So at the beginning of the year, Tim said to me, what would be helpful for you, babe? And I was like, well, if we could get Jess to come in like two hours a week, just in the afternoon, yeah. just in the evenings. Yeah. <laughs> and as she just because she's stepping up and stepping she's down. Make up their own and literally games. make up their own games. Like if they just have freedom, yes. then oh Precisely. football time. Go on in. Kick, kick, kick. <laughs> yeah. Yay. Well done. So like oh so two hours each day between like in the in afternoon evening period. Jess will come in and tidy up the kitchen for me to put all the dishes away. Oh, put all the dishes away. You want this back? And like, just whatever food is left out, make sure it's been put in the fridge, all those sort of things. You, Mums and dads and people that look after a household, you will know what I'm talking about. Yes, that afternoon clean, which can then turn into a whole oh, evening. Yeah, absolutely. So she'll do that for me, but also, if I've got like extra ironing bits to do, like mm. Jess will just run the iron over certain things for me, but our laundry is so much like, I would need to hire her for like a whole day once per week to do the ironing like all day. So she just helps out for me where, where necessary. You have to be careful of your fingers. Careful yeah, of your fingers, yeah. Good girl. There you go. How are you doing it, sweetheart? Yeah. Um, <clears throat> so she, but also, you know, uh, the best help is the help that you don't have to direct. Do you know what I mean? So there's a lot of times Jess will see like, oh, one of the beds hasn't got bed sheets on it, so she'll just do it. And yeah. Stuff like that. And yeah. that's the sort of person you need around like to help because I, I sometimes have so much going on to even think what actually needs to be done. You like it out again now. That would be another task to, to yeah. kind of like do a list of what needs to be done. Of course. You just want to, you want to stand and, on and, it now? And I, I was, so I was going to... That's what Jess does. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> no, I was just going to ask um, as a starting point, but now it's like the middle of the video, but that's all good. Um, no, 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 it's not a problem. Um, you know we love being organic on the channel and that is the whole point of it, to show some real life. And I was gonna ask that it's 10 o'clock yes. in the morning. Yeah. What have you done already? What have I done already today? So I started off by responding to some email inquiries that came through. This is when before. you woke up, This literally. is when I was in bed. So and like, when, when did you wake up? What time? So I first woke up at uh, I think it was 6.15 and I was, I think Houston came in, but then she just wanted to get in the bed. Mm. And then, it's fine, she can stay here. Thank you. Oh, you need to use a stool. Oh. Houston, Halo, can you right, well, just use I'll it go two and, yeah, just two steps. Yes, darling, sorry, you wanted to say something. That's when, when mommy was asleep. Yeah. In mommy bed. Yeah. I got out of my coat and yeah. I'd gone to mommy bed. Yeah. Wait, and then I turned on my iPad and Mummy on your phone. Yes, so she's Oh, right, okay, yeah. I understand. She was trying to do what you're doing, but her own way, right? Well, so basically, she was in my bed, and then she got out of my bed and went and got her toilet or iPod pad type thing. Mm -hmm. And then when I woke up at seven or five past seven properly, she was sat in the room on her pad, and I was on my phone in my bed doing emails. So oh, she explained yeah. it rather well to me. Yeah, yeah, very well done. Um, Good girl. So I was doing emails to start off with, then recognizing who I know else I need to get back to, but it was going to be a bit later. Sorry, darling, did you say, uh, only because I missed it, did, did you say what time you woke up? It was five past seven. That actually oh, five past seven today, okay, yes. cool. So, That's, um, that... it was originally quarter past six, but then I was like, I'm not getting up this time of day, because it's bank of the day. Not that that means anything, but I was just trying to, <laughs> trying to, <laughs> trying to have a little bit of extra time and um, laying in my bed. You've got to be careful, sweetie, because she's like, not realizing this can clip her fingers. There you go. So, yeah, oh, oh, see ya. <laughs> are you all right? What are you doing down there? There you go, you're on it. So two sex, two sex issues. Um, so that was the yeah, quarter past six. I actually opened my eyes properly at, at five past seven. Mm. Then I stayed in bed till quarter to eight doing like emails. Yeah. And then I got up, and these guys had kind of just kept these the little ones happy in mm. um, their bedroom. And then he was going. Halo. Can you no. wait a minute? Thank That's you. not how you carry on, baby. Hez is doing egg. Halo. Well, you guys be a good girl, okay? To, it's fine. Feel me? But can you check the date on that? Thank place? you. Yeah. yeah, so then I got up, got Houston, Rue, and Halo. So I got myself ready, mm -hmm. got Houston, Rue, and Halo ready. Yeah. Then I came downstairs and changed over a load of the washing. Yeah. Then I took some more bins out because I'd previously taken bins out last night, but just took a few of the extra bits of rubbish that had like, got to been inflated in the morning. Yeah. Put them out, got your t shirt, ironed it, got 
Uh, the old ones football kits I'm there for football kits for them got the clothes for the little ones because as you can see um yes could you just get halo please yeah, as halo. you can see like some of the laundry's down here and that's because last yep, night I was I was it's sat in the room with the halo. girls um and look at this look at her face what <laughs> yeah. are you like and I don't you can have some more food yeah you want a pancake yeah you want some food Holly can you get the pancake pancake Holly's getting your pancake and uh please was the word you were missing out yeah. there Please do. Thank you. <laughs> and they know the art of don't put her in the chair with nothing there. She's only going to scream in my face. Yes, you do. Right. Oh. Oh. Look at this face. And these hands are sticky. Oh my gosh, he's like, go. me. Yeah. Pancake. What's that, darling? He's like, what? Why am I having this pancake? Yeah, why am I having this pancake? She and the funny thing is, she knows why she's having this pancake. You wanna? She knows that we've just done the the <laughs> switch a Rooney. Yeah. And like popped her. Uh, yeah. <laughs> They're very clever, you see. Don't ever underestimate how clever they are. Nope. Um. Then ironed my clothes. Yeah. Then came downstairs and I started tidying up the kitchen because there was just crumbs and stuff on the side. Wiped it up. Put the um, some of the dishes over there. I'm yet to empty the dishwasher and wash up. Mm. And I'm going to transfer all the clothes back up to the utility room. Yeah. 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 And I've probably forgotten something else, but... You, you know what is crazy, right? Because I know a lot of people listening will think, oh, like, are you doing everything? But the funny thing is, other people are actually doing stuff. Yes, like, right. other stuff that needs to be done, yeah. which is... So, um, a lot of times, in times when I might be running around, obviously you can't just leave the kids by themselves. Plenty of times when daddy is overseeing the children, or maybe the old ones are getting breakfast for people, um, or go on. Sorry. Uh, uh, no, I was just going to say, like, just so people understand, I, at the moment we have three, four businesses? We have one, two, Three. Yes, four businesses we have at the moment. Four businesses at the moment, right? And that is just the beginning. Yes. Now, um, I was saying to someone else the other day that we just love taking on more work. I right? know. <laughs> it's like we, we've always been like that. <laughs> that right? be, I'm not one to say no. No. But yes, we get the We love a challenge. Exactly. We do um, love a challenge. But it's, yeah, th these businesses all have to be attended to and there is so well, many what things that go on, it, there really is. So if you're going to put your hand to something, you want to do it to the best of your ability. Hey, don't get out of your chair, sit down. You want to be able to do it to the best of your ability. And basically, I don't want to take on a task and then just be like, oh, I'll half do it. Do you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Because there's no point taking on a task if you're not going to do it properly. You, no, cheeky but I think you are showing the grim way again just how cheeky you can be. So, but Halo, can you sit here, please? Yeah, and you want to do it to the best of your ability. Do you know what I mean? So, mm. obviously, we've taken on four businesses. We've got obviously a family to look after, and we, are, you know, home educating the children and all this sort of stuff. And then we have a relationship to take up as well. Um, mm. But you we, want which, to be which we take incredibly important. Yeah, of course we do. Um, we take like, it one hundred percent because starting off the relationship is where everything started at the beginning. Mm. It was us so if that's not okay or if that needs more attention you've got to give it that attention hey yeah. you can come to me in a minute you've got to give it that attention otherwise you will just be cracking there and then everything else will just tumble because we are the foundation um so that's always got to be intact so say in the morning it's important that we meet up and we have our like little talk even mm -hmm. when i don't get fully filled in on what the days no, mm -hmm. <laughs> no that was just today but if we have our plan then that is so fundamentally important to how our day is going to go. You're getting tired, aren't you? Yeah. Do you want to go in the clothes and you can do some sorting for mummy? You sort out these socks. She just wants can the thing because them? that is still... Oh, thank you. Oh, sh oh, oh, thank you so much. Just what I wanted. Right. Thank you. A sock. Oh, wicked. What, are you kicking it? What, are you kicking it? You, <laughs> you want to kick the sock? You want to roll up the sock and play football? Oh, you yeah. want it on your foot? Oh, you want it on your foot? Uh, yeah, let's put them on your foot. There the mummy found the same one. Yes, yeah, so that is so fundamentally important. And obviously, wanting to do all the businesses well is, you know, for, it, for us, it's not. there's not even a question about that. Like, we don't want to have one business laying dormant, no. doing nothing. No. And for me, I just, at the moment, it's not always going to be like this. At mm -hmm. the moment, I'm like, there are certain areas that are getting more attention mm -hmm. than others. But I do want all areas to get maximum attention, mm -hmm. which... Absolutely. When you say it out loud, people might say that's impossible but I do not believe we, we do, not, do not believe in impossible nope. and Grimway Gang I think if you in your life yes that's why we See don't ya, wear that's socks why we don't wear socks down terms, here okay if you Grimway Gang in your lives can not can can believe that there is nothing that is impossible you will see yourself level up and level up <laughs> 
And we'd, we'd, we'd love to encourage you to be able to live with that kind of mindset as oh, well, sure. because I think it's great that you watch us and you enjoy seeing our family be, mm -hmm. be a family. But if I sit you here that way, if you fall back, because you fall onto me. But if you can take on some of the examples that we try to show you through how we are as a family, then you know that will really positively impact you as well. So for instance, right now, um, if Hez comes over here or whatever, or Rue and, and them not, but basically, while we are doing this vlog, life doesn't stop. So we've got Hallie and Hezzy. Hallie's over here. Um, and they are doing things for... The young ones. The younger ones. Yeah, like, what, what kind of things have you just done? Just while we've been doing this vlog, what have you done? So, um, got them Nutella toast. Um, gave them wipes. Nutella toast is like a chocolate spread yeah. on bread, yeah. basically. Um, gave them baby wipes to wipe themselves off so they're not messy when they get down. Um, gonna get them some water. Mm -hmm whilst also trying to do our food as well. Yeah, and I think this is very important to know as well. Hez, you obviously are known uh, to most for your football, and it's very important to know that this, all this stuff at home, it really, really affects you as a character. So some of the things, some of the problem solving you probably do on a football pitch is probably fueled by a lot of what you do at home. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. So yeah, it, it's, it, it's, I think, I personally as a parent I think it's very important to have you guys all experiencing life in a very real way so the quicker you learn how to solve it the better do you know what I mean and yeah. obviously we're always working that out but you know what I mean yeah. Um, but yeah but it all adds to your character and then you've got Harper fixing her own stuff over here yeah. what was that your is that your breakfast Bubba yeah. okay and guys oh that's another thing what what have you already done today Harper I'm going on a run and some exercise at home right okay cool so yeah yeah, so that's absolutely right. And Rubert, you okay? Yeah. And what do you think about, um, we're having a bit of a tantrum over here because I think she's just tired and doesn't know what she wants to do. But um, what do you think about how our family is? I think it's fine. I think it's a good family. Mm -hmm. Sometimes it's Mummy just gets a little bit stressed and but that comes with but life. But that, that comes with life. Like, yeah, like that comes with life. We all get stressed at times. Um, and that is absolutely true. Like, cry sometimes, of course, she's a baby. She's a, exactly, exactly. But yeah, so, but do, do you enjoy your life? Yeah, it is really good, especially with Hezzy. Especially with Hezzy, your big brother. I didn't have him, I didn't know what to do of them. Pretty good. I had another <laughs> That is very, very nice. I like that, Rue. Very, very good. Thank you. Oh, what was? Oh, that's very nice. What do you? What was you saying? Thank you to Hallie for. Oh, good food. Oh, very nice. So thank you, Hallie. Yeah. And so to you, baby, yes. who managed to quiet the storm with um, with uh, Halo. Halo. See, I was gonna, food and... <laughs> I was gonna forget the name. Um, but yeah, it's it is a real operation. It is, it's an operation, but one thing also that I feel like, sometimes you people may miss out when it comes to operating a household is, I could not do all of this by myself, and there's certain ways that my mind has probably thought prior to being married that would have not made our household run the way it has. Mm -hmm. So having a strong um, leader, so Tim at the, as the leader of our house, is so important. Having a strong man who will not shirk responsibility is so important to having your shit in order. So there's certain things that I might have let slip, which are only gonna create a rod for my own back later on in the day or later on in life. But Tim has always taken time to pick up on. Would you like to get down? Yes? Mm -hmm. oh, give mum kisses. No. <laughs> Love you. But Tim has never, like, what's that thing where you put all the stuff under the rug? Whatever that's yeah. <laughs> Never, like, just, he's never, um, you know, shied away from responsibility. And the responsibility of a household, I think, is one of the biggest responsibilities a man can have. Um, providing for your family. Yes, and making yes, sure that their character's being shaped in the right way. Yes. Making sure that your wife is loved. All of those things are what go into making this household run correctly. And I was going to say, like, if Tim's ever away, I am off balance. <laughs> just know. That. <laughs> and things are not the same at all and they don't run nearly as smoothly as it they do. It always goes both ways, baby girl. It well, always goes both ways. It's sign of a good partnership, isn't it? Absolutely. So yeah, yes. that is that is where we'll probably wrap it up today. But thank you for answering all my questions. You're very welcome. Good way, gang. I hope it's been a blessing to you today and we look forward to you joining us on another vlog. Love you. Take care. Bye. 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 Bye.